This week I tried to convert my HTML games into an EXE file. It's not as easy as I thought it was going to be. I started off by changing the file extension that got produced on the save button. It didn't work. It came out as corrupted and couldn't be played. But I also didn't think it was going to be that easy. After some research though, I found this and I had no idea what I was doing. Trying to write anything in C Sharp was like trying to write something in a completely new language. Eventually, I finally came across this, Electron. It's a development platform that turns HTML, CSS, and JavaScript into web-based applications. And after watching this video from Tyler Potts, seriously, this is a super good video. I highly recommend this video. You can find it by going into the helpful playlist on my channel. Thank you, Tyler. And this process was able to get my HTML snake game into an exe file. And this process was at least able to prove that I could turn my HTML games into an exe file. Now, Electron and Electron Packager, which you need to package the EXE application, uses Chromium, which in short just means that this 11KB file is now a lot bigger. Through this process though, I feel like I've gotten away from making something cool. This was able to prove that I could turn my HTML file into an actual game or an application, which was needed, right? Like I needed to do that, but it certainly is on the back end and it doesn't really do anything for the user. So I would also like to make the user experience just a little more fun. And unfortunately, customization and user profile saves are gonna require global storage and upgraded security. So I'll probably need to get a new hoster for that. Right now I'm using Google Domains and I don't have any global storage so people can't save their high scores. So for right now, I'm gonna just put my focus on making the entire experience a little more fun and a little more what I want it to be. I'm gonna focus on the development of a few more apps and a menu and making sure that it all just kind of feels how I want to before I move forward in a little more of a back end kind of way. So in the time being, go download the games. They're HTML, they're like 10 kilobytes big, you know, they're nothing. But it's still good classic games that work perfectly fine on any platform. So I highly recommend just go downloading them while they're still HTML files and I don't switch it out with the EXE and make it a whole download, right? Like a game. It does look like when I change it to an exe file, it will have to be like a zipped folder so that you download it and you extract it onto your uh, PC or onto your phone. And I don't really want to put that on the website right now because the HTML files just work fine. So go download them. Have fun, you know, enjoy it. It's just basic snake, block breaker, and a few more to come. And that's all, so thanks for watching, and if you like keeping up with my projects, then subscribe and ring that bell so you're notified whenever I post. And if you like the video, then comment down below, tell me what you like or what you wish I would have talked about. And like the video, it all helps boost the algorithm, and I'm so thankful that you're watching all the way. So, thank you. Bye.